that shit crack. Yo, to what is going on? Welcome back to the channel. It's way breezy. Everything easy, yes, sir. Yes, sir. And back with another reaction video, man. Your boy been grinding. Your boy been working, man. Every time I drop a video on this reaction channel, I'm dropping on my second channel also. So if you guys new to the channel, link in the description below for my second channel. So go subscribe to that. Go like some. Go watch some videos, man. Enjoy yourself. But um, one of my subscribers commented. He told me to actually let me shout him out. Let me shout this guy out real quick. Uh, right here, this dude right here. He said, "Kate Lego Manti." Kate Lego Manti, whoever that is, shout out to you, man, for reaching out and telling me to react to this. Said, Can you please react to my my Sandy Student Cribs episode one? So we're gonna react to it, man. If you guys know what that is, let me know in the comments. And um, yeah, let's get straight into it, man. Let me load that down, you know what I'm saying? I'm not sure if it's copyrighted or not. We're going straight to get it. It's a boy, Timber, and today I'm here with the Zanti Student Cribs. Today we're going to check out this beautiful Pathia novel, and it's called The Campus. Come with me as we check it out. Yeah. Knowing that in time, it will stop paying There's no point of being faithless. Hey. No point of being faithless. Hey. Focus on the blessing. The blessing. Yeah, follow the blessing. The blessing. Blessing. Oh, okay, okay, okay. This is how we're going to start off the video by first checking out the one bedroom apartment. So, let me show you what money like 7,300 rands. Come through with me. 7,300 rands. How much is that? Let me know in the comments below. Let's get it. So we start the scene off in the bedroom where you have like a double bed type situation for you and your person, you know, comfy and not so man can get comfortable do whatever he like whenever he like. One best and then as you proceed inside, what we have over here like a private TV, so man can get like Netflix, here's TV, you feel me? And then we proceed inside, um, what you notice is like a heater for winter, for the cold nights, for the nights when the honey isn't pulling through, you got something to keep you warm. And then what we have over here is like a study room. For man, because man's gonna hit the books. Man <laughs> really has to hit the books. So if you're trying to hit the books, you can hit them hard right over here. And then you can also like keep your stuff in these little compartments that are all over the place. And on my right, it's really good to keep your books whatsoever. I like to keep my books in a place like this. You got extra space for whatever you're trying to do over there. And then enough space for all that drip. That drip, you get to keep it in here. All of that, you keep your shoes maybe at the bottom whatsoever. And yeah, as you can see. Even though it's pretty small, it looks pretty nice. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. Um, it was like a straight, like narrow, like you know, it's like a rectangle room. So you just walk in, go in the closet, go in the fridge, sit in a chair, go to bed. You know what I'm saying? But it's pretty dope how it looks very modern. You know what I'm saying? As you can see, also it's like a fully for the kitchen. We've you got your microwave, personal microwave, your own fridge, you got no roommates, all of that. And then as you get to the kitchen, you got granite top kitchen, like your mama's kitchen. You feel me? Yeah, and that's what's up. So you need to put all your stuff over here, and that's place for all your spoons, your dishes, all of that, in, 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 and all a box. And then over here, what I have is like a bathroom where, like, you know, man's gotta hit the shower early in the morning, you know. You're trying to get there, water in. This way, you do it to get it done. You keep yourself outside, just so. Nah, that's a nice bathroom. I'm not gonna hold you. That's very nice. Shit, mommy, like, like my house. You know what I'm saying? Nice bathroom. You don't drop the soap. You don't drop the soap in here. You know, you got like your also like your own personal, like your own personal space over here, so you can do whatever you want to do in here. You know, without even being fucked by anyone whatsoever. That's the case. What up, 
once again so now what we add is like you know we call a shared studio which gives like more or less the same type of vibes like the single bedroom but what makes it special is about to come so in here we got the kitchen which has basically more or less the same amenities as like the one bedroom studio but um which you can see is like a more wider space and the reason for that is what i have right behind me which is like two beds facing each other which provides like a more intimate space between two people we're going to be sharing this place uh, what I like the most is like how these two face each other and like they kind of create a sense of environment where you can like be present in the moment with your roommate so we have this like <laughs> to be honest bro I wouldn't want to be I wouldn't want to be facing the bed like that way the way they have it I'd rather have it like you know like on the side so you don't have to look if you want to see them, you could look to the right. You know what I'm saying? But if you... The other way, you gotta like... Yeah, I know what I mean, man. Continue, bro. Public space for roommates A and space for the other roommate B. Now, as much as they might not have a balcony, but what we do find in this room and what they do have, however, is a view of Campus Square. It has an open plan which allows also for you to interact with your environment. Who architect Uti? This place looks industrious, rustic, nagogong, mara. We can all see and agree. It's got lonely rooms and enough machines for when an squad Uti gets it, he pull him back in. Now two study rooms which lock out the noise from outside. Very nice study rooms. The student accommodation. Sorry, those study rooms are very spacious. You like some other schools that I went went to, like their study rooms are very small. You know what I'm saying? So it's dope how they have like very a good amount of room to study in. Do that to do. Has laptops for you to use free of charge. to basketball I believe I'm the best in the world uh, nobody can really beat me or touch me in that sport if you guys want to challenge me we can set that up I'll fly out to Africa and we get that 1v1 you know what I'm saying and, and I'll put you on the YouTube channel another cool area that I'd like to show you guys is the game room This is a very good area to come and release your stress and just be amongst people who are just trying to tone it down a bit and just work it out. Yeah. You feel me? <laughs> I can't accept sight, but I lost me, dog. Mm. Lost me. Liar. Shh. What I'm about to show you in here is a very, very special place which I very much love. An indoor cinema. Okay, that's smooth. Like a whole you. No, that's what I went to. Had an indoor cinema. You know what I'm saying? Well, I guess they used like the projector screen. I guess they did. Yeah. So, um, you're trying to blow some steam, the best way to do that is in this indoor facility that we do have here at the campus, which is a pre footed gym with state of the art equipment like any other professional gym would have. <laughs>
the little studio, okay. Got the little calm studio at the crib. <laughs> is fire like what was that a pool like a pool a little nice little little dining that's just fire bro women swimming up yeah yeah that's what i'm saying 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 y